While kids may be feeling anxious to start their first day of school, it can also be scary for caregivers with concerns about COVID and school safety. I think a lot of families are nervous, not only about the normal things that we would be nervous about with kids going back to school, the challenges that a new classroom may provide, but also how do I keep my kids safe? Dr. Channing Brown, a primary care doctor for children and adults, emphasizes that getting proper sleep and having a structure can improve both a caregiver and child's mental health. One of the biggest things that we all can do is getting back in a habit of having regular bedtimes, getting plenty of sleep, and making sure that we are um, getting to take care of our own bodies and brains um, so that we can be there for our children as they go back to school. She says that self-care is a must for guardians. If we are not taking care of ourselves, we can't show up for our kids and we can't be there to invest in them and be the listening ear that they need. Dr. Brown shares that self-care can look different for everyone, but finding time to do things to relax as well as speaking with friends or a counselor can make a big difference. And if you are someone who's sending your child off to college, Brown says that starting their independence early could make you feel more confident as they leave the home. And knowing that you have been there uh, for some of their first times of maybe doing their own laundry, uh, making their own doctor's appointment, um, going to run to the grocery store and picking up foods to create a meal for themselves. She also suggests setting up a time to check in with your child while they are away. And while they're still at home, Dr. Brown encourages family dinners as they can be a really wonderful way to introduce to your kids that it's okay to talk about things that are hard. Um, it's a time to be able to process hard things that are going on in their lives. Sedona Meadows, Fox 54 News.